and Apple ID is like a special key, it unlocks all the best parts of Apple. You need it to download apps, you need it to buy music, you need it to use iCloud which keeps your photos and files safe. Without an Apple ID your iPhone or iPad is like a phone without service, it just won't work right. This guide will show you how to create your very own Apple ID. Don't worry it's very easy, we'll walk you through it step by step. Soon you'll be downloading apps and enjoying everything Apple has to offer. Think of creating an Apple ID like opening a door to a world of possibilities. It's the first step to unlocking a universe of apps, games, music, and more. Ready to begin? Let's dive in. Creating your Apple ID on your iPhone or iPad is as easy as pie. Firstly, find the Settings app on your device. It looks like a gray gear. Tap on it to open. Next, you'll see your name at the very top of the Settings screen. If you haven't already signed in, you'll see an option to sign in to your iPhone iPad. Tap on that. Now tap on, don't have an Apple ID, or forgot it. Here, you can choose to create Apple ID. Follow the on-screen instructions. You'll need to provide a valid email address. This becomes your Apple ID username. Create a strong password, and enter some personal information. Be sure to choose a password you'll remember. That's it. You've successfully created your Apple ID on your iPhone or iPad. You can now use it to download apps, buy music, and enjoy all the benefits of being an Apple user. Creating an Apple ID on your computer is just as simple. First, open your web browser and go to appleid.apple.com. This is Apple's official website for managing your Apple ID. On the website, you'll see a section that says, Create your Apple ID. Click on that and you'll be taken to a form. This form asks for some basic information like your name, birthday, and country. You'll also need to choose a strong password and provide a valid email address. Once you've filled out the form, click Continue. Apple will send a verification code to the email address you provided. Check your email, find the code, and enter it on the website to verify your email address. Voila! You've successfully created your Apple ID on your computer. Now you can use it to sign in to your iPhone, iPad, or any Apple device. Sometimes you might run into a small hiccup when creating your Apple ID. Don't worry, it happens. One common issue is forgetting your password. If you forget your password, don't panic. Simply click on the Forgot Apple ID or Password link on the sign-in page. Another common issue is receiving an error message that the email address you're trying to use is already associated with an Apple ID. If this happens, it means you've already created an Apple ID using that email address. Try signing in with that email address and see if you remember the password. If you're still having trouble, Apple has a fantastic support team ready to help. You can visit their website or give them a call. They're experts in all things Apple and can help you get back on track in no time. Having an Apple ID is like having a golden ticket to the Apple world. It opens up a world of possibilities and makes your Apple experience smoother and more enjoyable. With an Apple ID you can download millions of apps and games from the App Store, buy music, movies and TV shows from iTunes, keep your photos, files and contacts safe with iCloud, use FaceTime to make video calls to friends and family, and track your fitness goals and stay healthy with Apple Health. These are just a few of the many benefits of having an Apple ID. It's your gateway to a seamless and interconnected Apple experience. Your Apple ID is more than just an account. It's the key to your digital life with Apple. Therefore, it's extremely important to keep it safe and secure. Always choose a strong and unique password for your Apple ID. A strong password is at least eight characters long and includes a mix of upper and lowercase letters, numbers, and symbols. Enable two-factor authentication for an extra layer of security. With two-factor authentication, you'll need to enter a special code sent to your trusted device whenever you sign into your Apple ID from a new device. Be cautious of phishing emails or messages that ask for your Apple ID password or other personal information. Apple will never ask for your password via email. If you receive such a message, it's best to ignore it and report it as phishing. Congratulations on creating your Apple ID and embarking on your Apple journey. By now, you've unlocked the gateway to an incredible ecosystem of devices, services, and experiences. From the intuitive interface of iOS to the powerful performance of macOS, Apple products are designed to seamlessly integrate into your life. Explore the App Store and discover a world of apps that can enhance your productivity, creativity, and entertainment. Connect with loved ones effortlessly using FaceTime and iMessage, 
Back up your precious memories and important files with iCloud, ensuring peace of mind. As you delve deeper into the Apple ecosystem, you'll discover endless possibilities and a world of innovation at your fingertips. Enjoy the journey and embrace the convenience, creativity, and connectivity that Apple brings to your life.